Here's what I've done to go from this to this and lose about 10 kilos of body fat. Follow these steps, guys, because it really will work. And stay to the end, because the last one's a really important one. First step is obviously creating a calorie deficit. Obviously, you can do this through a couple of ways. You can either eat less, move more, or a combination of both, which will aid in being able to create a larger calorie deficit. And that is something I definitely did. So I didn't want to just completely cut back on calories. So I slowly increased my overall activity through implementing cardio. I started off with around 60 minutes of cardio because I was already doing cardio anyway, about 30, 40, 30 45 minutes um, during the week. So I started doing 60 minutes split over three days. Um, so at the end of each session, 20 minutes cardio, whether it be incline walk or maybe doing a Stairmaster or skipping or running. I love my cardio, so I do different variations of it. The next thing I did that really aided in being able to lose that 10 kilos has been not being overly restrictive with my overall nutritional intake. So still incorporating the foods I love, but in a balanced way. So typically I follow 80-20 rule, which 80% of the foods I'm trying to eat is quality foods, like very nutritious foods which keep me fill and make it easy to stick to the calorie deficit. And 20% of the foods I'm eating are going to be foods that are a little bit naughty, but it's done in a controlled way. For example, instead of having a massive ass chocolate bar, maybe I'm having a small chocolate bar instead. Not being as restrictive on myself has been a massive key element when it comes to losing body fat. Because the more restrictive you are with yourself, the more likely you are to end up binging and not being able to stick to the calorie deficit. But number three is accountability. So how was I keeping myself accountable? There's a couple of different ways you can do this. So obviously using progress pictures and using the scale on a regular basis. So weekly progress pictures and then assessing where changes need to be made. So obviously if I'm losing body fat via looking at the pictures visually, it does mean somebody to change whether it be the calories or potential activity or maybe even both or looking at the scale. So obviously weighing myself every single week and then taking the overall average. A couple of weeks go by and I noticed the average isn't really changing. It means something needs to be done. And those are three key important things, guys, that allow me to go from this to this, apply it, and it will allow you to have some success on your weight loss journey.